What am I going to be doing in 10 to 15 years? I don't know. Um, not 100% sure what I'd want to do exactly. In 10 or 15 years from now, I think if I don't go to the NBA, I probably want to do what my dad does. Um, 10 years from now, honestly, I have no idea because I want to go to like Sheridan for animation and hopefully if I get my dream job of which being a Disney animator, that's where I'd want to be in 10 years. Parents are saying that they want their child to have a well-rounded experience in, in high school and to uh, explore their, uh, their strengths and, uh, and different opportunities. Um, in grade seven, students start with my blueprint, exploring their strengths, their needs, taking a, uh, a survey, looking at uh, what their strengths are, um, setting goals, and learning about different careers. From the earliest age, Maitre's uh, passions have been art and music. That has driven who she is. Um, in grade five, she announced that she was going to go work for Disney. Being a pragmatic parent that I am, and I asked her, what's your backup plan? Her backup plan is pediatrics. So it's a huge spectrum. What if there was a way to make grade eight students feel more connected to their local high school? What if they even felt inspired? I believe we can do that with Explore High Skills. So I think Explore High Skills and the idea of starting a focus in grade nine can really help student success because it, it helps that student understand their direction in high school. Um, high school can be a big kind of scary place, but if you have some place where you know this is a program that I belong to, I'm with other students who feel the same way, my teachers support me, my parents support me, it just makes that entire journey uh, a little more meaningful to those students. Big fan of my blueprint. It is a phenomenal tool to help you navigate what courses you select and what options will open up to you in post-secondary. And even beyond, the guidance office has amazing tools reach out to them. I think students need to have some idea of where they're going with their futures. When they have the opportunity to focus their learning in certain areas that they realize they're interested in, that builds that confidence in themselves. And that's what allows them to, to find some sort of success and have some sort of hope for their futures. If I had started the SHSM program back in grade nine, it would have helped me get my certification sooner, in which case I could have done either more advanced or different certifications as I get older. But um, it definitely does help me get a job and does expand my resume because some employers do want people to be CPR certified or have specific certifications. We know that parents want specialized programs beginning in grade nine because this gives the students a great opportunity to see what they want to do post-secondary. If students in grade nine and 10 had a program like SHSM, it would really help them build their confidence and their leadership skills in the areas that they wanted to focus on. The SHSM program has helped me build my resume because I have these qualifications now that look better on me and I've developed a lot of skills and I ended up taking accounting which I hadn't thought of before and I realized that I'm good at this and you know it helped, my, helped me raise my confidence. I was a really really shy person and now I'm comfortable with talking to strangers and talking to people like that. My favorite part of joining the Specialist High Skills major program was that um, our class got to go on a, a group trips. It all helped us build enhance our like leadership skills and our communication within each other and if I had that in grade 9 then it would have been more helpful for me to find a group of people who are on the same journey with the same interest. So if we can take a specialized program like this and start it in grade 9 and build their confidence, build their opportunity to inspire them to be great leaders and great students within the school, this is a perfect experience for them to be able to do that. Do not be afraid to explore possibilities with your child. I don't know what my future will bring, but it's looking bright. <laughs>